Grilling out like a pro starts with keeping your natural gas grill running in tip-top shape. Grease buildup and clogged ports can mean scary flare-ups and cold spots that can put a damper on dinner. First, you'll want to get out your cleaning supplies. A spray bottle filled with water and dish detergent will do, but for an even better homemade solution, mix one and a half cups of white vinegar with one and a half cups of water, then add one and a half teaspoons of baking soda. You'll need a grill brush for the grates, a putty knife, cleaning rags or paper towels, and a set of kitchen gloves, as things will get messy. Next, run your grill on high to loosen up or burn off any food or grease. Keep the lid closed for maximum heat. After 15 minutes, turn off the burners and then locate your gas shutoff valve. Turn it to the closed position. Lift your grill lid and let the remainder of the gas burn off while the grill cools down. Allow the grill to fully cool before cleaning. With your grill brush, scrape off any remaining bits of food and grease. Repeat this for each of your grates. Then wipe down the grates with your cleaning solution and remove them from the grill. Next, remove any items covering the burners, like briquettes or heat plates. Clean them with your solution, dry, and then set aside. Brush any grease or debris off the burners with a stiff wire brush, paying attention to any burner holes that are covered or clogged. Then, wipe down your burner valves with the cleaning solution to help prevent uneven heating and hot spots. While the cook box is empty, scoop out leftover bits of food, ashes, and other debris. With your putty knife, remove any caked on or peeling areas and dispose. Then, rinse off the interior of the grill with a dampened cloth. Next, dispose of any waste in the collection bins underneath the grill. Remember, be careful about how you dispose of the grease. Wipe down the outside of the grill and any areas that come in contact with food. With your grill clean, you're now ready to reassemble it. Turn the natural gas back on at the gas shutoff valve. Now the last step is the best step. It's grill time. For more natural gas how-tos and homeowner tips, visit scanaenergy.com.